Now to new information on how repairs at Penn Station will affect commuters. A plan for NJ Transit was announced today that means cancellations and savings for some riders. Here's CBS2 political reporter Marsha Kramer with more. It may be hard to believe with all the train delays New Jersey commuters have been subjected to recently, but Governor Chris Christie says he's got an agreement from Amtrak that is just short of amazing. For three quarters of the New Jersey Transit customers, travel patterns will not be modified in any way. Christie says the massive Penn Station reconstruction project from July through Labor Day will only affect the Morris and Essex Line Midtown Direct Service. Those lines will end in Hoboken. Past trains and ferries will honor New Jersey Transit tickets. Fares for those lines will be reduced by between 56 and 63 percent. These fare reductions, in my view, are absolutely necessary to help to compensate uh, for Amtrak's failings. New York Governor Andrew Cuomo says Amtrak told him it will reduce Long Island Railroad rush hour trains by 20 percent. A source telling CBS2 some of the affected trains will be canceled. Others will stop outside Manhattan at Jamaica, Atlantic Avenue and Hunters Point. If you reduce trains coming into Penn, by 20 percent, it will be a summer of hell. Cuomo said some will crowd into already taxed subways, others will drive. He's appointed a task force to come up with ways to avoid Carmageddon, including new park and ride facilities along the Long Island Expressway, no tolls for park and ride participants, free buses from Nassau and Suffolk, high speed ferries, and new HOV restrictions. We have to do something. But Cuomo went even further, suggesting that Amtrak and President Trump turn Penn State over to him to fix, to renovate, and to run. This is not about politics, and it's not about partisanship. I don't drive. So you're stuck with whatever yeah, whatever the trains are doing. I'll have to drive. It's not going to be fun. Not into it. It turns my commute from an hour and a half to four hours. $300 a month. Would it's you? awful service. Well, Governor Cuomo also wants to fix the subways at the same time, offering genius grants, three at $1 million a pop, for new ways to run more trains and modernize cars. One Cuomo critic says it's a joke to think that a million-dollar contest can fix the subways. Dana. Marsha, thank you.